Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. Welcome to another video. So, I forgot to film an intro, but y'all, this moving vlog started off crazy because my whole closet fell out of the wall. Yes, I showed y'all that on my Instagram, but oh my God, I'm gonna include pictures right here because I thought I had clips of it, but I can't find them. I was editing a little bit of the video earlier and I just cannot find them. So, out here just like chilling and i heard a tumble and i didn't know what that was and i'm like what is what was that noise and y'all know you're in a new place all the sounds and stuff start to scare you so i'm just like Who, what's going on over here went in there and my whole closet was on the floor on the floor so i had to call maintenance and they came and like fix it and everything um which you will see but y'all <laughs> when i tell you it's been eventful okay and yeah. So make sure y'all hit that subscribe button, turn your notifications on, and follow me on Instagram and TikTok and all those good things for probably more crazy stuff because I'm sure some more crazy stuff is going to happen up here. But I'm not going to manifest that. I'm going to manifest that everything is going well. All right. He said it's supposed to be stronger. Y'all, let's just go ahead and pray because he said don't hesitate to put nothing up on here. So I'm about to rack it up. And if this thing fall out the wall again, I don't know. Like, is he going to fix this? Because I need them to know I ain't do that. We are re-putting up our stuff on this closet thing. I'm actually really scared, but I think I'll be okay. He put a lot of new he put a lot of new brackets and stuff on there. But I'm like, he used some of the same holes, so I'm like, what is that gonna do? <laughs> so I don't know, we're gonna see. Y'all, I don't know. We can figure it out. But um, then I was like, okay, this is like the perfect time to kind of declutter a little bit. I'm just grabbing a chunk at a time of everything that's laying on my bed. This dress, definitely keeping. That's like a staple. And some of my stuff has like <laughs> little drywall dust on it. Um, This dress, super, super cute. I wore this once and I'm not sure how many times I wear it, but I'm going to let it rock through one more season and see if I, you know, wear it again because it is really nice. Um, nice little red moment. Red is popping for the fall, so we'll see if I whip that out in the fall. That dress fits too good. This one I low-key can get rid of. I don't think I'll ever wear that one again, and I don't even know where this is from. The thing is, the weather is, oh my god, my eye. The weather is so weird. So like you can wear spring stuff one day and winter stuff the next day. Like, I don't know, it's just weird. So I feel like it's not the best time to put some of your winter stuff up. Like you should let it rock a little bit more. I'm definitely giving this thing away. My little Amazon dupe dress, so good. This, I don't know. I think I kind of just want to wear it for a photo and then give it away because I just can't. This is my favorite dress ever, my Skims. Um, what is this? The fits everybody like long sleeve dress fits so good. Just tried this one on in my recent Zara haul on Instagram if you haven't seen it. I packed it a little more than I did last time, so I'm nervous. We're gonna see what happens. If there's a tumble in the nighttime, it's in God's hands. <laughs> Alright, y'all. We got our really big mirror in. It's so big. So I'm about to try to open it up today is the day of my house for me so i kind of want to have you know just set up a few more things before everybody gets here ready for the reveal y'all this thing is not that big <laughs> I really thought this was going to be huge and it's not. She's cute. I just want it to be like massive. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. Okay. Yeah, this ain't that big. But she's cute. Like I thought it was at least going to reach the little intercom. This thing is not that big, y'all. <sighs> We're in my guest bathroom and I want to put up my frames. And I got some Decenio like years ago, so let's do that. I'm kind of thinking that I want to put like one here and then one at the bottom. I don't know. Let's try that out. 
because there's also a spot over here like above the like toilet and y'all hear that it's coming from this vent <laughs> it's the wind from outside i was thinking about putting something up here but i'm not sure yet so i think i'm gonna just do the two over here because you know if i'm here i'm gonna take a little picture you know it's cute little artwork in the background and i use these command strips the little velcro ones and basically you just break them apart i put them on the side i'm gonna show you and then they just like velcro together and that's how i had mine for like years in my old apartment and then they just come apart like that once you want to move them and then the next one is um, a body and I just stick it there. And they never fell in my old place. So I think this is a good little alternative. And then we stick this one right under. I had a leveler, I don't know where it is. Oh my God, they're so crooked. Okay, maybe I'll fix it if I feel like it, if I have time, but I need to get in the shower and get dressed because people are on their way and I look crazy. Look who's here. <laughs> yes, I'm in the new room. Yes. Like damn, she on move. She lit, your money too. Like damn, she on move. 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 She lit, your money too. Like damn, she on move. I have to let you go. go. In the mirror, I'm doing my dance. Hey, you packing out no vice pants. He a rapper, but don't gotta change. Sucking my waist, so I'm loving my pants. Like a million views in a day. There's so many ways to get paid. I tried to, but he begged me to stay. Babe, I'm not staying, I just wanna play. In the party, he just wanna run. All right, so we have a couple updates in the office. As you can see, I have an arch mirror here. I showed y'all that that was too small. So I found this one on Crate and Barrel. And, oh, hello. That was my chair. It is like the perfect size, all of that, but it's expensive. And it doesn't get here until May. This is the one I'm looking at, the Edge Extra Large Black Arch Floor Mirror, $800, which I could kind of see why it costs that much. Like I'm not, not even gonna lie to you. Like to be that big, you know, I would, I would pay that honestly. So I'm slightly thinking about that. It's just, I feel like, I've been trying to get these videos out and one thing after another just keeps happening. Like the mirror too small, I thought it was gonna be big enough and I measured it, like tried to measure on the wall and really thought that it was gonna be massive when I got here and it's not. <laughs> so I'm just like, okay, let's just go even bigger. This one, let me see the dimensions of this one. Okay, so it's um, 80 inches high and then 48 inches wide. So it's nice and tall and nice and wide, which is what I want. I just feel like it'll fill the space a little bit better than this. Like this is just not taking up the wall like I need it to. It's just not doing it for me. It's, you know, it's just not doing anything. So I really want something that really comes up in like, you know what I'm saying? I really want this whole wall to just be a mirror pretty much. It's not terrible. It's a nice mirror if you're interested. I got it off of Amazon. It came super quick and all of that good stuff, but I just want to go bigger especially from a creator standpoint and then also from my picky behind standpoint like i just need the pieces to hit i need my vision to come to life so she just wasn't doing it for us we're gonna return her and <sighs> i'm really thinking about this one and then also this freaking chair that i showed y'all on my instagram is still here y'all i am slightly debating on returning it just because of the hassle but let me show y'all what i'm thinking about getting so i went on to castlery i think that's how you say it and i found this one and i think this would be so i think this would be so good the marlo performance boucle armless chair three seater sofa it's 70 inches wide i feel like my pimple patch is just really messing up the vibe anyway i really feel like that is gonna look so good only because say if like you're sitting on the couch and you only catch like one half of it you don't know how you know what i'm saying it doesn't have arms so it just can elongate the room in my opinion i feel like that would just flow a little bit better in here than this chair this chair is just too 
like bulky it just kind of like it's like a box you know what i'm saying and i feel like this will sit flush to the wall a little better it will just make the room flow a little better so we're gonna completely just we were making progress y'all okay i promise but now i want to decorate the shelves on my desk okay so i already was like trying out a few things so i picked up these faux flowers the um tulips and faux baby's breath from amazon y'all they stink okay i don't know why but they do not smell good this is also from ikea so i put this on here just as like a little refreshing situation since i did want to go for like a black and white theme i just thought these would be you know bring a little something up okay so i put these over here and then this is also what i was kind of like trying and i got this this is my polaroid my little polaroid that my sister got me for my birthday last year i think i think it was last year and i think she got it from target i'll try to link it down below um, but I really love it. So I got this little bowl. What does this remind y'all of? To me, this reminds me of Jonathan Adler. I don't know if this is actually a Jonathan Adler bowl. But y'all, sometimes the good stuff be slipping into home goods. But I got this from Home Goods, so I can't even like tell y'all where it's from. But maybe I can find a dupe or something similar and tag it for y'all. But my thing was, I wanted decorations on here but i want them to be functional this is very the vibe that i was going for very minimalistic simple but it's a bowl so it can hold stuff so i was putting all of my um polaroid film in here so obviously this is my office where i want to create content and stuff so i want to keep everything regarding that in here you know now i have this little cute base situation again it's very functional I already have a bunch of junk in it this holds all my cords Oh my God, I found my lighter. Oh my God, there's a lash spoolie in here too. This don't belong in here. Yeah, I got this from H&M Home and then I know I wanted to do like a mix of books or something. So I got this nice, what is this called? Beautifully Organized by Nikki Boyd. I believe she's a black woman too. Yes, go ahead Nikki girl. Okay, so I definitely wanted to have some type of book situation too but i didn't want to make it too heavy and then i had like some lenses i could put up here and then also my camera i think like maybe that's all i want to do for this shelf i don't want it to be too cluttered for sure i also got this from home goods i have the tag on it if you want to screenshot and you like it i've told y'all this before but you can call the home goods and give them the department number the style the type and then they can tell you if they have it in the store or not so just screenshot that and then call your home guests and see if they got it because this is so cute um but yeah just as i suspected it's not short enough and then of course the plaque the youtube plaque when i hit 100k it's not gonna fit on the shelf so i was thinking here and then maybe put something else like above that all right y'all a moment of truth y'all she is so cute but remember how i said i moved to get away from like all the noise and all that y'all it is so noisy over here i don't know what i thought i was doing but what is y'all like what y'all digging in the ground the ground look fine to me like i moved here to escape the sound and it's worse <laughs> you just cannot escape it but anyway um let's just ignore <sighs> oh why is it orange all right, y'all, another day, another, let's get this house together. Y'all, I'm so sick of this. So, we get ready to go to um, the Crate and Barrel outlet, and then also, I need to go pick up a package from my old building, because I don't know why. I'm still getting mail there, but whatever. I got on this Amazon bodysuit from the Pumi. Then I got on these Zara jeans that I got in New York. These jeans are so tight. <laughs> oh, Jesus. You know how, like, your jeans be tight, but you know, like, if you wear them for a little bit, they gonna stretch out and they be all right. And then, y'all, I'm wearing my MFK Gentle Fluidy. Look how I'm tearing this up. Like, that's embarrassing. We just gonna keep tearing it up. I got on my Yeezys because they're just comfortable for, like, running around. 
now I'm like, which bag should I wear? Should I wear this one? This is a Margiela bag or my Pauline bag that I got in New York. That vlog will be coming soon. This one just has to go out before that. Try to back up and show y'all my outfit. Okay, okay. And then these are the shoes. My little Yeezys. I feel like the, the um, beige hint in the Yeezys kind of go with this one. But this one, I've just been kind of dying to wear it. My stuff is already in here, so maybe I should just go with this one. Okay, I think I'm gonna do just this one because, I don't know, it just looks good with the shoes. I could wear different shoes to make the Margiela one look better, but I don't feel like changing it. So let's head out, let's go look at some furniture. And then maybe I could stop by HomeGoods and see if they have any other pieces that I might like. Y'all, my car, just, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you, hold on. Like, this is not okay. But y'all know me. Like, I don't want to pay for all of that. So, honestly, I think while I'm over there, because I know there's a car wash over there, too. Y'all know I've been over to the outlet before because that's where I got my coffee table from for my last place. This is cute. Okay, so didn't find anything groundbreaking in there. I found some cute stuff, but it just wasn't groundbreaking, like I said. So yeah, I'm about to head to um, Home Goods, but I'm gonna try to find a car wash. I low key wanna wait and just wash my car myself because I did just get some new car wash stuff. Hold on, let me see. Let's call Poppy. <laughs> That's right. Hey, when are you going to be home? Um, about five, six, five, what's up? Today? Yeah. Can we wash the cars tomorrow? We can wash the car tomorrow. Okay. You might wash two. Hmm? You might wash two. Which one? The two more drive, the black one, the one you had before. Okay, I can come early. Okay. Okay. All right. All right, I'll see you in the morning. Okay. All right, love you. Love you too, bye. Okay, that saved me like $45 because I was about to go to this uh, car wash. It costs like, I really want to say like $45 to do the outside and the inside, I think, so. All right, we got the package from our old place. I'm at home goods right now, but let's open her up and see what this is because I actually don't know what this is. Oh, Lord. <laughs> oh. oh, Jesus. Do, 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 do. Fenty skin, just like I thought. Ooh, okay, Fenty. It's a little PR package, which I need to get them to change my address. This is their thick and smooth, rich peptide eye cream. Let me see. Ooh, and you go like this to get it out, right? I'm tripping. Is mine broke? Like, what's the D? Oh, here we go, boom. Ooh, this is nice. Rihanna not playing with them. This is like really, when they say rich, they really mean it. Like this feels super like buttery. All right, let's head into Home Goods. Um, again, looking for like, what is he looking at? I, um, <laughs> I'm still looking for, um, oh my God, what? 
I'm looking to see if they have mirrors in here too because I know sometimes home goods be having like really big mirrors. So we'll see what they have in here plus any type of like decor that I can put on my desk. Alright y'all, we are back. I ended up having a jet out of home goods because some weird stuff happened. The guy that I was seeing was like staring at me. He ended up like moving his car to right where my car was. And then like he was following me through the store. He even like came up to me and like, chow. All I'm gonna say y'all is be safe out here. Seriously, be safe because people are crazy. Like I don't know, I don't know. He just, oh gosh. Anyway, so I got home and I was trying to look for my Amazon packages but I could not find them. But yeah, I'm home safe. Took all the precautions, like did everything I need to do to make sure, you know, he don't know where I'm at. Like he wasn't following me, nothing like that, you know. He even ended up like, um, I ended up like when I left the store, made sure he like drove off all of that stuff. Like when he left out the store, I stayed in there for like a minute and then I went out the store to like make sure he was gone. And then I went into another store to kind of watch to see if he was like circling around or anything. And after that, came to my car, or whatever. And I actually saw him like circling around. So I know my way through that. Um, shopping center i've been in that shopping center before so i know like all the entrances and exits and stuff so i just kind of went the back way and just came home you know like i said make sure you don't follow me or then and yeah so whew. people are crazy um but it says that my order was delivered yesterday and I, I don't know where it is. It's full of stuff for the office too, which I'm like, dang, I wanted to kind of set it up today. But this is some of the stuff that I did get. So cable management clips. I think I'm gonna put this like on the, it's supposed to be white. Oh, it is. <laughs> I'm like, hold on. It looks like this. And you pretty much just like stick it on the side of your desk and then your cords kind of go through there. So my computer cord, I just kind of have it like behind the desk. So my idea was to like put the cord thing right here so that it won't fall down and I don't have to keep weaving it through the desk. Peel this off. And boom, there we go. Ta-da. And then I also picked up these transparent sticky notes. They're just so cute y'all. My sticky notes now, oh. My sticky notes now are a beige color and they're cute and all, but I'm starting to run out of them. So I thought I would try the transparent ones out and look how cute they are. And when you write on it, but it's kind of like a little bit translucent. In my drawer now, I just have like a couple of dividers because I literally have no clue where my other ones are and I feel like I gave them to my sister. So we got our beige ones, translucent ones. I'm a sticky note girl, so I literally have like all the sticky notes there we go and then these are my favorite pens these are the zebra sarasa dry so good y'all and y'all know my planner girl so i be knowing all about the pens and like <laughs> about all of that type of stuff let me put my pens in here and i also got these i don't remember where i got these from they were either from amazon or like cloth and paper or something like that again if you're a planner girl you know what all of that is my white out i can put this like right at the top and that's it for now like i'm also going to keep my sd cards in here i got this little holder for christmas but it's from amazon i found the packages this is for my um dresser drawer this is like an acrylic like type of memo board i guess you could say as you can see it says like monday tuesday wednesday thursday bad bitches have bad days too and then you just set it like this. 
on your desk and you can like write on it. I'll put it over here. Ta-da. How cute is that? Like, come on. Then it even has little dips in it to store the marker. And then, is this made for your phone? Cause your phone could definitely fit. It like barely fits with the case on it, but that's very cute. I really love this. It's kind of giving me like, you know, a snapshot of your week. Like you could just look over and remember, oh, it's Wednesday, but I have, you know, certain things coming up. Hello, I also did not film my outro, so here I am again. But yes, next up, I'm gonna be doing my bedroom. I am like charging all of my stuff now because I try to do it for this video, but of course my drill was dead. Like just didn't have nothing to, you know, do what I need to do. So that gives me a little bit more time to like keep shopping and like really get super organized because I have a vision for my bedroom and I cannot wait for y'all to see it. So stay tuned for that. It's just gonna be purely probably my bedroom and maybe my closet as well, just cause it's, you know, connected, but I'm excited. So just stay tuned. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the moving series. I think this is the last one just because I'm so settled in. I say that as I have like a mirror on the floor here, but I'm so settled in it and I really start to feel like this is home. Like y'all, we are home, me and you. Cause y'all like to say, oh, who is we? But I'm just so grateful for y'all. Y'all have shown so much amazing support across all my platforms about my moving journey and like all of that and been so patient. Oh my God, y'all been patient because literally things have been going wrong, been set back. Yeah, make sure y'all stay tuned for the bedroom makeover, which will be coming soon. And then also my office tour, which, I don't know when it's gonna come y'all because the furniture that I ordered is on back order, of course. So just stay tuned. Y'all will see little glimpses here and there, of course. But yeah, that is it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I love y'all so much. And I will see y'all in my next one.